Hi, this is another video to check how to find short in motherboard. As we say before, uh, each capacitor here or each coil here, this coil here, this uh, represent a voltage source so if I have any short for any circuit here I need to check where is the short so I will check the short uh, using ohmmeter now for example this coil here this voltage here about uh, uh, 5 to 12 volt so I will measure between the ground and this coil I change the positive or negative as you see this read some value and uh, stop the reading here this one this coil as you see it's read about 4 ohm what does that mean that mean there is short here so I must check the capacitor here Each capacitor here, as you see, it's read about four or five. Maybe this IC have some short, so I need to replace. Now, for example, this coil here. Also, I measure between coil and between the ground. As you see here, does not read or high value. Ah, from this side, when I change the minus and positive, negative and positive, now it's read about 340 ohm. What does that mean? That means this circuit is working okay. Now, I come to this capacitor, this capacitor also here. This capacitor, the voltage here, they reading about uh, 2.5 volt. So now if I read between this capacitor, it's read about 4. 150. I change the probe. It's read high volt, high value. So that means circuit with this capacitor is okay. Now here. I have the processor. So I read the capacitor in the processor. It's read about one ohm. This side also one ohm. Now if I replace if I replace the processor and I check the value of capacitor how much it will read in order to find if there is short if there is short in processor or processor circuit
as you see, I remove the processor. There is here capacitor. I will check the reading between this capacitor. Let's read high value. That means it's okay. Circuit here in this one. Also read. There is some clicks here. I change the direction. As you see, it's read about 85 of. That's okay. Here we check. As you see, read about 85 high value. So that's okay. 85 ohm is okay. Why? Because the circuit of uh, processor, as we said before, is uh, supplied by uh, 1.2 or 1.5 volt. So when if you read any capacitor. In the processor uh, voltage circuit, it will read uh, maybe 20 ohm, 30 ohm. It depends on the laptop design. Now, this capacitor here, the value is 6.3 volt. If I measure between this capacitor, as you see, it's read about. 769 that's mean the circuit is okay there is no any short in this circuit this one another one of a 775 voltage supply for the reason this circuit is 6.3 so that's mean this value is okay now we come to this uh, this IC here, this is the BIOS chip. So voltage supply for this BIOS chip is 3.3 uh, volt. So I will measure between the ground and between the voltage pin. See about 500 ohm. That means BIOS chip IC is okay. Now this is IO. IO IC. I will try to zoom whatever I can. So IO supply. 3.3 volt and 1.5 volt and so if I measure any capacitor beside the IO as you see it's read about 360 here from this side 70 so the bias chip is okay Now I come to this IC. This IC supply about uh, 1.5 volt. So any capacitor beside this IC, that's mean this capacitor will connect with voltage supply for this IC. So I measure here about 460. This capacitor here, reading very high value. That's mean I see is okay or the voltage source for this IC is okay. Now 
I come to this circuit here. This is battery pins. On here, this capacitor connect with battery pins. So I need to check the circuit connect with battery. I measure this capacitor here. Sorry. I need to measure this capacitor here. As you see, or from this side, this read about 500. So that's this capacitor is okay. And this one here, this one here. 500. That's mean the circuit is okay. Now, wherever I want to check any circuit here, I must know the voltage supply for this uh, circuit in order to check if there is short. All this capacitor is working like filter and voltage store. So, between this each capacitor, there is positive and negative. And if you check with the overmeter, it must read some value. For example, it's 900. That's mean this capacitor. It's sometimes read very high val val value or read small value, but not like this short or 3 ohm, 5 ohm, that means this capacitor is short. Here this one is reading about 114. This one 113. Any IC here, if you want to check, you see the squatting diagram. Now this IC, the coil here beside IC this coil will supply volt for this IC. So, if there is any short in this IC, I must check first thing, I check the voltage. So, I I make reading between, between the ground and the coil. As you see, 240. What does that mean? That means the voltage supply is okay. There is no short in this IC. From this side, I come here. For example, now this coil supply processor. So I measure between coil. I measure between the ground and this coil. As you see, speed high value. About 100. About 115. On this side, 85. On this side, 85. That's mean the circuit is okay. Now I check here. This is USB connection. As you know, USB supply with five volt. So if I want to see. If there is any short, if there is any short, the new USB circuit, the laptop will dead. When no laptop will 
uh, not uh, power on because the IO IO if he detect any short in any voltage IO will not give the BIOS and processor the order to power on IO will measure any volt here leak or short and it will shut down uh, shut down the, uh, the laptop now I check here with the ground here this pin number 4 with any USB this for 5 volt supplies as you see it's read about 731 ohm that's mean this one okay this pin is a ground this one as you see 700 also air ground air data there is data in and data out this capacitor would filter the voltage supply to USB so if there is any short I check the capacitor here as you see it's read about 490 and this is high value value that's mean there is no short. This capacitor here also read high value. I hope you understand uh, this uh, this tricks to find uh, short and laptop motherboard. If you like, please. Press like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching. This is Teach, teach Yourself.